I got for selling me clothes, Jumping for selling me blame. If ever I list for the soldier again, devil shall be. The lady and gents here have a poor porch proper. This is like yeah, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just destroying your dignity, sir. All you respect. Just not use the attachable one. But yeah, no, they're all the rage, mate. I think they're a fad myself. I don't have one because if I put one of them one round the house, the missus will think. But it's just doesn't. I tried Yeah, but you've got trousers on. I know, but what waste are you anyway? Twenty-eight. Hey. Drop your kegs. He would do Can't that, he would do that. Let oh. me know when you find one of them. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I bet it's the best stuff for you you're going to get all weekend, sir. I'm probably excited, do I? No. Yeah, it has been a long weekend. Yeah. <laughs> it's only out in the woods. It is. Yeah. Especially when you were just a guy. What goes on at the gathering stage? Yeah, yeah. It usually does. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but ladies, did you get that? A full wave of my jacket there for 45 quid, yes, mate. Look at that. Very nice. Just a casual. Yeah, no, no it's... Uh, Got, you know, here's a four wave of mate, isn't it? 45 yeah. quid. Mr. Fry said it, I asked him before and he said, yeah. um, well, it weren't his, but he, yeah. he asked me before. Sorry, and I said, how much do you reckon this is? He said, uh, 60, 65. Yeah. Perfect for me. Because, yeah. uh, no, ladies and gents, obviously, this is a bring and buy sale. Uh, you bring stuff, you mark it up, and then you buy it. It's uh, similar as well. We've had, uh, I've had a few results. It's good. I'm not doing any mad impulse buying, but David, as always, has had a few results. Same, Same as Alan, Alan King CLC. <laughs> nice little Ventile smock, very, very cheap. And a couple of pots. But yeah, no, you just got to kind of be here. Uh, people unloading the kit. I mean, it's just everything. So it's just people like me and you who are bringing the kit down to uh, flog. And there we have Mike Smith there, lighting moving tent. And uh, some, some some really nice kit here as well, mate. Isn't it? Yes, there is. Yeah. And some of it is silly prices, like the jacket you got on. Yeah. And the Ventile smocks going for like under 100 quid, and I think yeah. you're having a laugh. Now, there's, there's, there's something in for everybody, I think. Uh, David's haggling has been legendary. <laughs> Did he not shift on them two shirts then, mate? Oh, I don't. Did you go? Again. Thank you to all the ladies here because they just give up their time for nothing to keep it all run. Okay. And it's tense as everything. Sorry, mate. Burners. Just... Top end burgers, you know, this. Uh... Alan. Got a nice whiskey burn. Poncho. Mm -hmm. we'll see. <laughs> <laughs> yours, mate, is it? Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Gonna drop the prices. No, I got it. Huh? And they're not being rude, the only way you're going to make any money on this, mate, is dropping your kegs. Cottage in oh, the old skills. But Paul, he looked quite cute in that quilt, didn't he? He, did, he looked very sexy. He did. Yeah. He had a lady proposition him. I'm serious, I've got it on film. <laughs> but anyway, um, when I do say there's everything you mean is bring it, mark it up. Well, if you're going to put a silly price on summer, uh, then it's still going to be here uh, at the end of the day, ladies and gents. But for me, this is a little bit of a highlight. Oh, don't think you want to get kids on. But, you know, there's all the leather craft stalls here. It is something for everybody. Um, I think that's like a, a second hand but good knife stall. They'll make your own knives. So 
natural. Go and have a look at this man's shops here. So. Still Tantos there. Very nice. Oh. No jewelry we convict her because I've got that many jackets in. Probably just be a fair one. But Dave, you've had a right steel wear, mate. Yeah, it's got. A, yeah, we'll chuff for that one. Uh, a Vensol jacket, mate. I think it's double lined, and that. It's yeah. got a nice lining on the inside. Got, yeah, yeah. Again, I can really. We've got windy. I just feel it totally cutting out the wind. Vensol. It's not meant to be 100% waterproof. No, it's no. It's like the it's like the ferrule wave and stuff, yeah. but it's yeah, it's pretty good. You know yeah, what I mean? And because uh, it will eventually, because I've had them and I still got one. Is. Uh, Comes, but I think that someone's done something with these sims as well. But anyway, um, cracking little jacket there, mate. I love that style, as you know. Yeah. And uh, one in yeah, there. you got there and two pockets as yeah, well. The hood with all the stuff comes on the inside. Yeah, and you can pack the hood away, yeah. and you got then the wind. Yeah, the wind cheek, you're that, yeah. mate. Just yeah. get a bit of ventilation on that. I'm just thinking, it's the only chance I'm going to have to have the jacket on and look a bit smooth, mate, because it's like proper cool. Yeah. But again, if I hadn't got that Arctic one, mate, we were we. You know, we've discussed this, we would have had a, a, like a proper stand up. Yeah, fight. yeah, you know, we would have been outside saying, so Come on, you know, come on, get them up. Come on. <laughs> we're going to take your jacket back, mate. Would you like to tell me? Steady yourselves, ladies, yeah. gents. Seriously, this is a Ventile smock, cracking brown, calm, not a mark on it, mate. Yeah. A little bit warm, but. Oh, that's great, I love that. Is, with this, you, you wash it two or three times and it beds in, like, yeah. you know what I mean? So yeah. it don't mean it's not been worn to death because there's, there's no wear on it, it's just got. No wear, like, pop no. the wall away, it's just a normal type of way. Ventol does do that, mate. Um, would you like to tell the ladies and gentlemen how much I allowed you to pay for this? Because <laughs> you got it. Uh, £85. And, and you wanted? A one Yeah. So, uh, nice, nice. you know, a bit of, bit of haggling there, yeah, you know what I mean? Nice. But a nice guy anyway, you know what I mean? Know, yeah. yeah, he's a nice guy. And he knows his stuff, you know what I mean? But, yeah. Yeah, all all it's all good gear that he's had. Yeah. A unit in the, uh, well, a military unit, he did say. You know. No, he didn't want to do it. And he was, he was nice because he, he was a follower on Instagram and he followed me on Instagram, which is quite nice. You know, I mean, to someone to say, you know, you know I mean, nice did pictures and stuff like that. I can honestly say, I have no followers on Instagram because I'm not on it. On it, no. <laughs> <laughs> but yes, Dave, this is a nice, you know, a little bit of kit, mate. And Keep your, that yeah. goes up. I know I've got a fat. Yeah, quite a few. It's too many to list, to be honest. Well, go on, start at the top and work down quickly. Um, I've had a nice uh, uh, Col Coleman... Um, uh, 15 quid. 15 think. quid. Yeah. Brand new. They were like 100 quid. Yeah. Um, a Coleman a call box, yeah. which was 100 quid I got for 25. Yeah. Bought, watch out, but yeah. Sound, a nice bite. Yeah, the Dragalon ones. That's for family camping, so oh. it's great. <laughs> um, um, a 400 pound... Um, mountain equipment minus 25 down bag that's lovely. yeah 100 quid one that's like stunning that is yeah, yeah. That was a result, yeah and um what else did I get? I can't, oh, a nice little ottoman stove over there a cracking little thing on that that's brilliant that is i like stoves and petrol one 20 pounds £20. nothing that is yeah. and um a big slick Aussie thing Oh, swag bag, and obviously that come up in an upcoming video when we go out next, that'd be my first... Uh, yeah. I'm actually thinking of using it tomorrow night. Yeah. I'm thinking of taking all that down and doing the night with the bag, the sleeping bag and the swag bag. And all night, uh, tomorrow night, I'm thinking of doing it. So I might strip all that down tomorrow afternoon. Yeah. 
to set the swag bag up because I've got the shelter over there with Mike and all that. We can sit under that if it's raining and I'm sleeping in it in the night. Obviously, I ain't going to get a chance to use it for a week or two or whatever, you know what I mean? So it'd be a nice, and that sleeping bag, it'd be a good opportunity to give it a blast. Oh, you, you, you could be like in the North Pole in them, mate. Yeah, I know. I might be, I'll be too hot, but I'm going to use the old, well, anyway, we'll see you tomorrow. Yeah. I set it up, I was yeah, no, you weren't here actually. Because I was down there, yeah, 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 yeah. You was wheeling and dealing, weren't you? Ducking and yeah, diving. They, they haven't even labelled it up, and I'm having a look. Yeah, <laughs> we're just getting on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. No, we're 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 we are probably. Even, I'm even at the moment. Even. So for what I've bought to what I've sold, I'm still, I haven't spent any money. Obviously apart from the ticket and the petrol, oh, but he's done, a, some he's done all right as well, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 very civilised pie and mash. Now, anyway. I'm going to get a check to my sausages, which yeah. are down now. Sorry, mate. I'm going to get out. Oh, so actually feel like the bird. Yeah, I'll better grab it off him, because, like, you know, yeah. the more he wears it, the I mean, more sorry. he won't want to give it back. No, he's, uh, all I have actually got on is a T-shirt and a shirt, so that is probably just spanking your size as it goes. Yeah, no, it actually is, yeah. yeah. That's a very, very... Uh, we just on that car keys we did pass them. Yeah, you did yeah. one of the somewhere. And there's... So they went on goes like that, mate, and it's got that. Yeah, no, it's well. It's a nice, nice bit of kit. There you go, mate. Thank you. Thank you very much. Mate. Anyway, ladies and gents, we did uh, walk this way a little bit, but uh, there's loads of people up there. That's nice to go up there, have a, a bit of social and that, and yeah. then come down here, and it's a bit, a bit quiet, mate, isn't it? Yeah, I've done it twice a day, come back to you. Yeah, so did I, mate. <laughs> But the old uh, snug pack is uh, rapidly becoming my tent of choice. Well, it's got a Van Gogh Beta 350. You've just uh, fed your face there, Mike, haven't you? Yep, yeah. stuffed my face. Yeah. Nice. So that's one of your favourites. You often have that, mate, isn't it? Well, it's a staple camp food, isn't it, really? I suppose so, yeah. Me, my, my staple camp food is mash and yeah whatever people feel sorry for and give me. <laughs> you some no, I know, mate. Oh, no, I'm, I'm, I'm cracking on there, mate. There's my little fart chariot, and that's the first time I use there because I come back a bit damp, mate, and just put me, uh, you know, snug pack, uh, whatever one it is on, and uh, yeah, just woke up dry then. But oh god. The coffee press there. I'm going to do a separate video on that, but that is just proper quality. I bought myself a standing little cup there, ten pounds, twenty-seven pound, posh coffee. And what I like about it, it does a full cup, and then you, you get another half a cup, so you're getting a thing, Bob. Anyway, anyway ladies, this is a say what Optimus SR8. David just having a little tinker with. Paid 20 quid for that and they go for sod knows how much on eBay. But I know what he's like, I know what he's like, he'll, he'll, he'll dibble that, we use it once or twice and vlog it here next year for three times what he bought before. SX flag. Very nice one. I don't know where you got an SX flag from, mate. Didn't even know we had a flag. <laughs> Cracking time so far, isn't it, mate? Yeah. And I think we have done a little thing coming over in a bit of the quiet and that, you know what I mean? Yeah. Because, oh, bless them, don't get me wrong. Do you know what's been really nice about this? That many, like, families have come down here. It really is a family place and that as well. But the kids are okay for a little bit, but after a while, just get on your wick, you know what I mean? Because you can't eat a whole one. And I don't shut up. <laughs> anyway. Say goodbye, Jane. With the shotgun in a hand. Oh, oh. There is Mike Smith drinking a fruit based drink. <laughs> Consider yourself unfriended, sir. I've oh, got this young lady on today. Absolutely fantastic. <laughs> She don't know how to
Oh, we can't say it's uh, proper community down here. She don't know how to let it go This hooks it up like how to let go She's trying to let it takes him from the streets And takes him from the bar Here's somebody to fall at yeah. Someone to pay the plan off If you're young or old, no, I don't matter if you're young or old, because everybody loves that old sweet rock and roll. No, 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 it don't matter if you're young or old Because everybody loves, loves to rock and roll Love time! That in front of me, on the left is David Wise You can notice the ear and uh, Paul, or his brother Little Mendel, but they're in good company Yeah, don't get this at the bushcraft, Joe. You I'm glad, okay, this I'm glad that's the last one of the night because that was getting very broke back. Oh, we let it? Oh, you got to get really close, didn't you? No, no, that, 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 was, that was getting very broke back mountain. It was. It was sexual, wasn't it? It was. But we got beer. That's our excuse, anyway. This is cool. We'll just keep turning. We'll just keep turning. I'm going to zoom out because I don't do much editing. Oh, no. <laughs> Dave's got it now. Go, Dave. Go, Dave. Dave. It's Dave Fez. <laughs> Hello, ladies. Drop me out with your fire. Hey. Reason hey. about your paper. I can't afford the price. This, guy, this guy's a really good singer. He really is. Here I said I'm crazy about you, baby. I can't afford the price. You're a high class movie, so I guess there ain't no doubt. I'm going back home, back to my old girl soon. My old cousin. She ain't a pally of mine, just plain old kidding school. Kidding school. Let's 
Discreet filming, did you? Hmm? Didn't mind me doing this little bit of discreet filming? No, a police f- film and take as many photos as you like. Right. I'm struggling here with a relatively thick piece of uh, thing. Yeah. But because of the color, I want to see if I can still do the impossible thing and turn it into an arrowhead. Yeah, it's a nice color, isn't it? Yeah, yeah because it's a French flame. It's kind of rare. Yeah. And very, very beautiful. I'm trying to see if I can clean it. It was very, very thick. Yeah. Oh, I'm, I'm guessing there, but it's going to be a tiny arrowhead. So what I do is I, I make a platform here and I try to really push off some thick pieces. Yeah. You see it's relatively thick still, but... we get the job done, I reckon. See how I push off. It's hard to remember the names when they're in another language, unfortunately. They sound almost like what they would be. Almost half. Mispronouncing it horrifically. Well, at least you don't have to learn lots of words. There we go. It's a very tough thing, though. It's actually quite annoying. I don't like what I'm doing. English thing. Yeah. It's not a nice little guy. Temper, horse dung, deer hair. Fired from wet up to 1200 degrees. Um, so that's just an air hole at the bottom? Yeah, it's a venturi, yeah. The chimney and the lid are absolutely, totally not necessary. 
Obviously, ladies and gentlemen, this uh, gentleman needs no introduction. They're doing a brilliant job with the kids, absolutely fantastic. I do not like um, getting kids on film trying to go round the back, but we all know what Will Lord uh, does and he's doing, you know, at the very best. But I don't want to. Keep